this video i am going to discuss ll1 parsing algorithm and this is the video part 3 uh, the grammar is given we need to construct the parsing table the grammar is already a uh, uh, recursive and uh, factoring uh, removed grammar so first of all we need to find the uh, uh, first and follow here first of is id and opening bracket and follow of e is uh, dollar and closing bracket first of e dash equal to plus and epsilon first of and uh, then follow of e dash equal to dollar and closing bracket first of t equal to is id and opening bracket and follow of a b star plus dollar and closing bracket first of all we need to construct the uh, table one passing table consists of uh, non terminal and terminal symbol your uh, symbols are id uh, plus uh, uh, opening bracket star and dollar no need to consider epsilon here we need to consider the first uh, of e uh, e uh, id and opening bracket first of e is id and opening bracket so e will be apply here t e to t dash and then uh, another e applied here for opening bracket e to t dash now uh, next uh, for non terminal symbol e dash uh, there is a plus and uh, epsilon for plus uh, e dash to uh, e dash to uh, plus t e dash but uh, no need to enter uh, epsilon so then we need to follow the uh, of and we need to follow find the follow of e dash here follow of e dash is uh, dollar and closing bracket so we will apply uh, dollar and closing bracket here e dash to epsilon and we need to apply e dash to epsilon when there is an epsilon then we need to consider follow symbols that is dollar and closing bracket and we will put e dash to epsilon in both cases now uh, for t here uh, if uh, id and uh, opening bracket so t will be applied id for t to ft dash and another will be this opening bracket that is t to ft dash uh, next uh, next one is uh, t dash uh, t dash consists of star and epsilon first of all applied star that is uh, t dash to star ft dash and as there is an epsilon so we need to apply uh, follow uh, symbols that is dollar plus and cl closing bracket so t dash uh, that is dollar uh, t dash to epsilon and the next one will be the plus to epsilon t dash to epsilon then uh, closing bracket that is t dash to epsilon and last one is f to id uh, f to id and uh, opening bracket so f will be applied to f to id and f to e f to e so this is known as parsing table